I'm just talking about Kanye West. Apparently, he posted on Twitter that he is running for president in 2020. Uh, this is what the tweet said. He said, we must now realize the promise of America by trusting God, unifying our vision and building our future. I am running for president of the United States. Hashtag 2020 vision. Now, this tweet has over 600,000 likes, 300, over 300,000 retweets and over 60,000 comments. OK, I even saw Mal Marcus Brownlee in the comment section, you know. We've seen situations where, you know, you know, politics can get a bit uh, circusy. Um, it can get a situation where people can put their names in the ring, just to do that, just to build up their profiles. People thought that that's what Trump was doing. People thought that when Trump ran for president, I think I even had that in my mind. I'm like, why is he running for president? This guy, has, he has a reality TV show, you know, he's running for president. You have that thought in your mind, but then when you sit back and see what has occurred, whether you dislike or dislike, that's not for me to, to say or nay, but there have been other people who have tried to do what Trump did and they have not been very good at it. I mean, look at Michael Bloomberg, you know, uh, so you have to have a plan. You have to be all in. So if Kanye is all in on this, then I mean, why not, you know? And also, you know what? Let me just tell you the intelligence level of people on social media, okay? The intelligence level of people on social media is very, it's very uh, mediocre to, I would say, average or below average. Because Kanye said this, right? But instead of Kanye trending, Kane was tr trending. It was spelled uh, K A Y N E. And that was, and it was Kane West, not Kanye West, Kane West. That just shows you the intelligence level of people on Twitter and, and why you have them so uh, enamored by using it because you have a lot of unintelligent people, okay? You got Kanye West announcing he's running for president and Kane West is trending. I don't know, you know, I don't know. Uh, do they even know who Kanye West is? Okay, so do some of these people even know who he is? Because I think a lot of these people, may but there are some who don't they may have heard of him but they may not know him they may not even know how to spell his name that's why kane west was trending which is very you know if you if you're a person out here <laughs> that was on twitter putting kane west in your tweets then obviously something mentally is not right with you some, some maybe you need to back away from twitter back away slowly but surely back away from twitter because it may not be the place for you if you're screwing up this bad now again he could be doing this now the one thing i will say about kanye west whenever there's music to be promoted he does certain things in order to push it we've seen it with various albums M one of the most notable one was when he was releasing uh one of his albums in tw i think it was 2007 2008 and 50 Cent was releasing an album at the same time and they went head to head. Uh, you know, who can sell the most? You know, look at, uh, to a certain extent, you no know, Yeezus. Um, you can look at uh, My Dark Twisted Fantasy. You can look at uh, his latest project, his, go his gospel album. You know, it had a conservative, you know, Christian theme to it. And now, you know, he released a new song recently and he's talking about running for president. So you don't know if he's all in or he's just doing it for promotion. It could be, could be both. But if you want to win, you have to be all in. You, you know, it, it can't be no going back. But I'll be very interested to see how this plays out with Kanye West.